if you believe you can you can welcome to the show on if you bad tv and you really feel bad because this show will be on two of them and i want to say a big thank you to you for watching previous episodes commenting and liking today i'll be talking about goal settings goal settings so important especially at the beginning of the year and welcome to the year 2022 if this is the first time you're watching please subscribe and let me know because that's a way to let me know that you're enjoying the content I'm putting out and also share too with your friends. Thank you so much. My name is Ifi Madu. I'm an actress, content creator, and a life coach. Yeah, motivational coach. <laughs> okay, let's just get on with it quickly. Um, goal setting is really, really important for everything you need to do, no matter the career path. As an actress, as um, as a content creator, I have goals I set for myself daily, monthly, you know, and it helps me to stay in focus with the overall goal for the whole year. So you can break it your, down your goals in different ways. But there's so much, um, there are just three key points, and I'll take it quickly. Set clear goals, okay? You need to be exact. Like for me, I could say I want to be in 10 movies in this year. I want to create um, three posts, you know, for my YouTube channel every month. And then I have to be really clear. I could say I want to have 10 subscribers per day. That is my goal for the day. Or then times seven, that will be 70 subscribers per week. Uh, I might say we need to lose weight. But how much weight? We, we shouldn't just make things vague. We need to be exact about what we want to do okay you might say you want need to want to sell 10 houses if you have the real estate business or you need to get you know xyz customers daily you know these are exact things you need to put if you're saying you're setting your goals okay and you need to do your homework and do your research don't just say this this that perhaps it's not possible in your country in your community or not really i'm not giving you the impossibility mentality but perhaps the framework or the environment doesn't you know support your kind of goal so you need to do your research and you need to be clear on what you want okay and um the second thing is set three milestones okay milestone goals like for everything like i could say i i said i might want to have 70 subscribers per week or 10 subscribers per day so what is my milestone what is my milestone per month so even if i wasn't able to get 10 subscribers per day so what milestone per month can i celebrate if i have 50 subscribers um in the week can i celebrate that or in two weeks if i have 100 subscribers as against 140 what are the little milestones I can celebrate and because what it does when you achieve little milestone goals it sends the right message to your brain it makes you happy it increases your emotion increases your energy increases the energy of your team too if you're not working alone so it's important you do that if you are into marketing or if you are into agriculture you know how many seeds must I plant by day how many customers or how many um, New people must I just call up and tell them I'm into events management and this is what I do, you know, and um, how many um, events do you want to plan or weddings do you want to plan, you know, per, per month and, you know, you just need to give yourself a milestone goal. So if I'm able to lose maybe two kilograms, two pounds, five pounds per week, this is something that I could celebrate, this is something for me to be happy about and then... Um, so because this is important because your goals should stretch you it shouldn't stress you it shouldn't make you happy it shouldn't make you go into depression make you unhappy make you angry i know short um, tempered with other people no your goals should just stretch you stretch your mind stretch your body a bit but it shouldn't stress you okay and then the third one finally is make your goals visible i think i'll do another um content on this 
on vision board vision board is so important vision board has really really helped me and then you need to make your goals visible most people might say they want to write their goals down most people might want to do a vision board but either ways you need to be able to see your goals maybe first thing in the morning and also last thing at night and if you can also have your goals in the office if you have a private office space please go ahead and put it there the more you see your goals the more your vision is expanded and you'll be surprised you'll be able to do much much more before the end of 2022 i love you all so much you're watching if you bad tv my name is if you bad madu follow me on my instagram um my social media sites my other social media sites you can see it on your screen and please leave a comment and let me know how this content and this particular topic has really helped you i love you all so much god bless you and i'll see you soon Ciao.